For more timely and regular updates, please subscribe to Computer Age and make sure you hit the bell icon. Thank you. Hello friends, uh, welcome to Computer Age. Uh, I hope all of you who are watching this video have TWRP already installed on their phones and as many of you might not be knowing that new TWRP version has been released the new TWRP version is out if you don't have TWRP installed on your phone you can go into the description there's a link uh, to my video that shows exactly how to install TWRP and root your phone so this video is all about it and I hope you watch it till the end and update your existing TWRP. So first of all you need to search your device on the official website of TWRP that is given in the description below. You can go there and search out your device and download the .img file. Once again I will repeat here you have to download .img file you don't have to download dot zip file because uh, we are going to flash dot img file and not zip file okay so uh, let's sit out and I here I I assume here that you know how to get your phone into downloading mode you have to press home button volume up button and power button at the same time and you would get your phone to downloading mode now here as you can see there are two options at the bottom the first one is select storage and the second one is install image I will show you right from the beginning I will tap on install option and I will go down and select install image since we are going to flash .img file I'll tap on it uh, the time I tap on it, it uh, Suna changed into install zip that means we have successfully selected the install IMG now you have to select storage I hope you have kept your file somewhere on your micro SD card you can also place it in your internal storage and you have now to search the folder where you kept the TWRP as you can see it's TWRP 3.1.0 you have select it and there are two options the time you select it first one is boot and the second one is recovery since we know TWRP is uh, recovery in nature so I'll select it and swipe so as to flash it okay it's completed now I'll reboot my system and wait for it to get rebooted okay it has rebooted I will unlock it and I'll switch it off again so that I could show you uh, which version or uh, to what version the TWRP has got updated to okay now I'll power it off again and get my phone back into recovery mode by pressing the same combination of home button volume up and power button at the same time here it is home button volume up and power button okay we are into TWRP recovery I don't know what uh, changes have been brought in but it's always recommended to have latest version of any software or any operating system because the latest uh, versions cover the bugs and errors which used to appear in the previous versions you can see here it's 3.1.0 so I, it means I have updated to the latest version now I'm going to check what features have been incorporated I guess uh, there could be there there may be a lot of lots of features but I don't have time to see it all 
okay so the, uh, this is it uh, you have to follow this video so as to uh, update your TWRP2 latest version okay Okay guys, uh, thanks. Thanks for watching this video. Please share, subscribe and like this uh, video. I